Hey there, Geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to show you how to show all the icons in the system tray in Windows 11. That's over here. These hidden away behind the little arrow. Now, in Windows 11, unlike Windows 10, it was a one-click setting and you saw everything. They may change this. I don't know. One of the things I have to assume is because the start menu now is here in the middle that maybe they were afraid they would run into each other and conf get confusing. That's a possibility because this used to be over here, so we had room for everything, as cute as it is, but here we are. So this may change down the road, but with Windows 11 a week away from release at the time of this video, this is what it is. So there's a couple ways to do it. One I'm not a fan of, so I'm going to give you the better idea now because I like to get to the point when I can, except for now when I'm intentionally blabbering on. Anyway, so click this little arrow right here and just drag it over. It's kind of a neat way to do it and just drag everything in. The downside is, now you can see the arrow's gone because I dragged everything over. Let's say you get an email. All of a sudden the arrow's going to pop back up and your email notification's hidden, so you got to drag that over. And so on and so forth with anything else that pops up that normally sits in the tray. You want to switch them back, click it, move it to the left, the arrow will reappear, let go. Now I've hidden away that. So one handy feature is you could actually hide away the stuff that maybe you don't want to see. And one more, and we're right back where we started. So here's the other way to do it, although it's not perfect, and that is, of course, in the settings. You can use Windows I open settings, but let's just click on the right click on the taskbar right here and do taskbar settings. Scroll on down while we're here, just worth a mention. Your start menu, see the widgets here? Which one is it? This one? Widgets. You can disable that stuff while you're scrolling past it. Task view. Just so you know. No big deal. All right, let's go to Taskbar Corner Overflow. Here's the problem. It doesn't have everything listed here. I don't even have Microsoft Teams, so it doesn't do me any good. But to give you an example, you could click on Windows Security, which is down there. And there it is. But that's kind of the hard way to do it. And it's a little sloppy right now, but once again, I don't know, a week away from release, hopefully they'll improve this. I'd like to see all of them. I usually come to about here personally, but who knows what they're thinking. But then again, as I said, Windows 11 is different, and perhaps this is by design that you can do this as you want and quickly customize it however you want to do it. So there you have it at the time of this video. That is how you can show all your icons in the system tray in Windows 11. Bottom right corner, subscribe button. Thanks for watching as always. See ya.